First, it was a very good script. And I just thought it was unusual. It had a great, it has a great sort of charm to it. Um, it's a family movie. Um, it's a great character, great script. And it was a chance to finally work with Peter Chelsom, who I have known for over 25 years. This man who has this singularity of vision, um, ob ob obsession, passion, this drive, um, I, I guess you could say it's so, you know, loosely based on a sort of, you know, Elon Musk, Richard Branson, that kind of sort of businessman, scientist, entrepreneur, you know, um, that um, he fulfills this, this, this passion and this ambition for the only then to be thwarted and is presented with, uh, I think, an even greater challenge, which is um, the young boy, um, Gardner. When we first see Nathaniel, we wanted to see the, the youthfulness, the drive, and the, the energy um, of someone that can run Genesis, that, that can literally come up with these ideas and, and, and make them materialize. So he wanted to see that that drive and that passion and the enthusiasm. Um, and then we have that sort of, I step back from the company 16 years later and you see that not only being outside, not only taking a back seat or becoming, or becoming increasingly more reclusive, but the strain of keeping that secret of, uh, of Gardner has taken its toll on me. And it's only when they start discussing bringing him back that that reignites the old, you know, the, the old the fight in, um, in, in Nathaniel. So he wanted to just see he wanted that. He said, look, you know, when you see this man, when you see Elon speak or you, you see those interviews with Richard Branson, it, it, it's, it's like, um, it's everything is just possible. There's, they're, 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 they're sort of, it's in their, it's in their DNA. It's like they are just, they're, they're driven, they're unstoppable. 